this is one of the leguminous crop this is cowpea and as you can see uh, here is the nodule uh, inside this nodule uh, there are many microorganisms microorganism. and when this nodule nodules become pinkies pinkies uh, it will be very effective for nitrogen fixation nitrogen is one of the most abundant plant nutrients and it is also one of the most common soil deficiencies several environmental issues have been raised about nitrogen supply to soil urea is the common source nitrogen fertilizer being used in our country yearly there is shortage of nitrogen fertilizer during the peak demands in the country biological nitrogen fixation is important tool to reduce application of external chemical input and the sustainable way to add nitrogen fertilizer to the soil biological nitrogen fixation is the process through which rhizobia fix atmospheric nitrogen in the form utilized by plants legume is source of protein dietary fiber vitamin and various micronutrient it is used mainly for nutrition, soil fertility management, and has great potential for export. There is great potential for the production of legumes in our country. Since natural nodulation is found less effective to achieve expected growth and yield, there is need of inoculation of legumes with effective strain of rhizobia. Rhizobia, a type of soil bacterium, has a positive impact on the growth of legumes like lentils. There is huge opportunity to boost production by utilizing rhizosphere colonizing bacteria which can reduce nitrogen fertilizer consumption and safeguard the environment. Rhizobium recognizes the host legume specifically resulting in the legume rhizobium interaction. The specificity is conferred by a variety of signal molecules produced by both rhizobia and the legumes. As a result, only rhizobia that are especially compatible with the given legume species can induce the development of root nodules, which in turn increases nitrogen fixation for enhanced legume production. Therefore, isolation and characterization of new rhizobium strains are necessary for production of quality inoculant for using in cultivation of legumes. Though isolation of effective strain and use of effective strain inoculant has great potential in production of legumes, studies from different countries have shown the efficacy. There is little or no practice of using rhizobium inoculant in the production of legumes in Nepal. This would be the pioneering work in context of Nepal. We could relate very less with previous results. Nepal is rich in diversity. There are many advantageous rhizobia unexplored. It carries huge potential for innovation. Given the degrading condition of soil in Nepal due to heavy use of chemical fertilizer in production of three crop round the year, government should mandate one should be legume. Different programs and policies to motivate legume productions, government should also focus on research activities for on-field demonstration. Private sector should work in close contact with government sector for production and commercialization of inoculant.